everyone, I'm Hebba and welcome back to my channel. As you can see, I'm not wearing any makeup. We are masking today. Sheet masking today. And I wanted to try this. This is by Lancer. This is the Lift and Plump Sheet Mask with Vegan Stem Cell Complex. It was in my Beauty Fix subscription box for the month of February. And when I went back and I saw how much this cost, wow. I was surprised. For a box of four, it's $120 for four sheet masks. So I'm thinking, what the heck is in here? Okay. <laughs> I mean, so let me make sure, yes, you get four of them for $120. Okay, so I just have to see it on camera and see if it does anything. And we'll see. I mean, I do love my sheet masking, and I have sheets, I have the sheet masks that range from a dollar to probably $15 to $18. And this one's the most expensive one I have, $30 for one sheet mask. For one sheet mask. <laughs> All right, let's see what this claims and see what it has in it. Okay, now on the back of this, it says the highly concentrated sheet mask features... Palmitol, pentapeptide 3, and apple stem cell compounds to provide a tighter and more lifted appearance. Rose water, centella acetica extract, and sodium hyaluronic quench the skin with natural humantics to help improve hydration and suppleness. An ideal mask to help smooth skin post-procedure or even as a daily indulgence. Yeah, this is an indulgence for $30 a sheet. Sorry. <laughs> On the Dermstar website, under the product details, it says that this will give your skin a more radiant glow when you use the Lift Plump Sheet Mask from Lancer Skin Care, which is ideal for dry, normal, and mature skin types. So I'm guessing oily skin, this probably wouldn't be right. This, this probably wouldn't work for you. Designed to easily... Alleviate fine lines and dehydrated skin, its powerful formula is infused with hyaluronic acid and apple stem cells. The key ingredients are apple stem cells, which deliver a plumper, firmer looking appearance. Hyaluronic acid boosts the strength of your skin's natural barrier to keep your skin protected and healthy. Niacinamide accelerates collagen production to strengthen your skin and reveal a more youthful appearance. Ginkgo biloba. I believe that's how you say it. Centella asiatica and calendula. They provide antioxidants and phytonutrients that help you maintain a youthful, firmer looking complexion. Okay, well let's try this sheet mask. Let's read the directions. Gently remove and discard the plastic layer. Smooth sheet mask over cl clean, dry skin. Leave on for 10 to 15 minutes. Peel off sheet mask and discard. Lightly pat any residue serum into the skin. Do not rinse. Okay, let's do this. My skin is dry and clean. Woke up this morning and just did a rinse over my face. I typically don't like to use a cleanser in the morning. Yes, I am one of those that do not cleanse my face with a cleanser in the morning. When I wake up, I'll just rinse it with water, pat dry, put some essence on, and then either go uh, work out, which I love to do yoga. That's, that's my workout or put on a mask in the morning and then and then do my morning routine. But yes, I am one of those that do not cleanse my face with a cleanser. Don't hate. <laughs> All right, well let's let's rip this baby up and put this on my face. All right. So yes, my face is clean and dry. Regular sheet mask smell. All right, here it is in here. I want to keep the serum if there's any serum left in here, I want to keep that in there. It's nice and moist, which is good. Okay, here we go. Let's remove this plastic for the paper backing. All right. Let's see here, let's do this side. Or does it doesn't matter. I don't think it mattered. All right. It does smell good. It doesn't smell very perfumey. It smells really good. This is where I always have a problem where it doesn't lay down on some mask right here on the sides of my nose. Put the rest on my hands. <laughs> okay, let's see what time is it. 
It is 9.57. So I'm gonna keep this on for, I'm gonna keep this on for 15 minutes. All right, I'll see you then. <laughs> okay, I forgot to mention that it does have some cautions on the back of the mask here on the package. It says avoid contact with eyes, do not use on wounds, rashes, or swollen areas. Alright, now I've had this on for a good 25 minutes. It's starting to dry around my chin and so I want to take it off because when a mask dries it's kind of, to me, I think it's pulling moisture away from your skin so be on the lookout for that. So you don't want to keep the mask on when, when it starts to dry. First thoughts when I put it on, after about five minutes, I started feeling tightening in my skin, especially my chin area, so that's good. Okay, let's take this off. All right. Okay, let's see if there's any more left. Nope, oh, there's some. Yeah, I'm putting that baby in. <laughs> okay, probably should put a side-by-side -side picture of how my face looked like before I put on the mask and, and after. Now, I do feel like my face is really hydrated. I do feel that. And I do feel that tightness, especially right in here in the, in the chin and mouth area. And I checked on the Nordstrom website and one mask there sells for $35. Yeah, I thought it was 30, but it's 35 for one mask. Or a pack of four for $120. You'd think, my math would think that it would be $30 each, but I don't know why it's 35. But anyway, now I, I still feel the tightness in, in my skin right now, and I still feel the hydration into it, but I'm still feeling the tightness. So that's that's good. Now, do I think it's worth $120 for four sheets? Probably not. Not for me, at least. If you know, if you have the money and you want to buy it and you like the results of it, you know, go for it. It's it's all whatever you like to do. But for me, I probably will not be spending $120 for four sheet masks. There are other sheet masks that I have and that I've used that cost way down more than what this cost. I have sheet masks that range from a dollar all the way up to 15. Granted, yeah, $15 is an expensive one, but not 35. <laughs> not $35. I mean, you have the Korean skincare mask. I mean, they, they some of them cost a dollar. Granted, some of the dollar ones, they just give you the hydration, but there are some out there like the, the pharmacy ones that works well, the Florop, I always mispronounce that name. Floropy masks. Uh, even the Sephora masks I really like. There's even one that I have, the Lancome. That one's a little bit pricey on the pricier side, and I really like that one, but it's still a lot cheaper than this Lancer one. It does look good. I mean, I do like the results of it, but do I think it's worth it? No, I don't think so. I it, Because most of these results are temporary. So it's good, you know, if you have an event to go to, that you want to, you know, a little hydration, a little plumpness to put it on and then put your makeup on and then go. Yeah, I don't think it's worth the temporary results. You know, I probably will probably put like a note on the bottom in the description box to see how it looked and see if it kept up its firmness during the day. So I'll probably do that. But again, for me, I probably won't be spending that much money on, on this mask. I'm sure it's a great mask. I'm sure people love it. I mean, yes, I do have, you know, expensive taste. Just a tad. My husband will tell you that. <laughs> but there is a certain limit to what I would buy. So, yes, that is my demo and review of the Lancer Lift and Plump Sheet Mask with Vegan Stem Cell Complex. All right, you guys, I hope you like this review and demo and maybe a little bit of a dance in there, too. <laughs> 
All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button so you can see more videos like this. And you all have a wonderful day, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.